is up you guys how you been how you feeling how you doing me i've been blessed i've been blessed i've been blessed um right now let's just start the video what's up you guys and i am out here in Fontana, I believe. I've been just doing my side hustles. I got a new hustle other than Winolo. Winolo's still a really good side hustle. Um, a really good, actually, if you don't have a job, an alternate job that you can get to get money fast. Oh, wow, look at this. You can, if you have a remote control car, this right here would be a dream. But. Anyway, I hear somebody ruining a milk so far. Anyway, all right, I found a good spot right here in the shade. Let me tell you the update of what's going on with my Air Force journey. On the 2nd of January, the NCO from the Navy, the Navy, what? The Navy hit me up and he says, we're going to submit your waiver now. And I'm like, no, <laughs> no. I said, what? What you mean we're going to submit my waiver? I thought I was permanently discharged. I thought I had to wait six months. What's going on? He tells me, well, since you're out of debt, we can submit your waiver. And I'm like, wait a minute. No, 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 no. I'm already in the process of joining the Air Force. That's what I'm telling him. And he asked me if I'm already in debt. And of course I say, no, not yet. I'm waiting on my waiver. And so he tells me that he's getting information from the chief. He's getting two sides from the chief and from his higher up, a chain above, whatever you want to call it. So he tells me he will call me back with more information. It has been four days. He hasn't called me back yet. So pretty much how I feel about that. I, I'm happy and a, a bit like kind of like irritated and then a bit like I don't care. And then I, I don't know, it's, it's whatever. I'm already over the whole Navy thing. I'm, I'm over it. I've been over it. Whatever happened, happened. And this is where I am now in my life. And I'm happy. So I had to actually go to my, well, my Air Force recruiter sent me a text saying that I need to sign paperwork so that I can get the, uh, so that they can get the waiver um, pulled from the Navy. I really think that's the reason why the Navy had called me because they had probably thought that I did not move on, that I didn't try to go to another branch, which they were pushing for the Marines for me to go to, which kind of makes sense because if I would have joined the Marines or tried to, they were probably going to do this anyway and then tell me, oh, we're going to submit your waiver and I would be all happy because I don't want to join the Marines. You never know what their plan could be. I'm just making stuff up, not saying that that's true. Anyway, I went down to my recruiter, signed my paperwork, and also updated my pretty much my application profile for the Air Force. And he pretty much told me that we're waiting for the Navy to release your waiver. So that's where I'm at now. I'm waiting for the Navy to release my waiver. <laughs> I'm very happy because I believe that the Air Force has something for me. Even if they don't, I will go back to the Navy and I will do the whole Navy thing again, but I will not go to the same station. I will not go to the same recruiting office. I won't. Um, I have nothing against them, not at all. The original 
recruiter that I had for the Navy was excellent. He did great. He did everything he could to get me in. It's just things didn't, it, it wasn't, it wasn't right. So whatever. Now I'm just here, you guys. What have I been doing? Just working. I'm independent contractor. And I do Winolo, I do DoorDash, and I do Postmates. Winolo is pretty much an app for jobs. Get on there, jobs pop up around you, and you accept or you decline or you just leave it alone. DoorDash, you're a delivery driver and you go to different restaurants, you pick up the order or you order it and you pay for it. Not you, but they give you this red card, DoorDash. You pay for it through this. They had put the money on it. Order it, pick it up, drive to the customer, and drop it off. Postmates is the same thing. I haven't started that yet, but I will soon. That's how I make my money. That's how I survive in this world that we got going on right here. Hold on. I am trying to change my channel name. It's walking in success right now, but I actually want to change it to walk colon in success. So walk in success or walking in success. So I'm not able to do that because I already changed it. So that will be coming soon. And I might even change it again to my actual name, which is Cecily. Let me know what you guys think. Should I go with walk in success? or my name, which is Cecily, C-E-C-I-L-Y. That's all I got for you guys. I just wanted to get a real quick update on what's going on with me, my Air Force journey. Thank you for watching this video. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. This is the channel to be on. Watch me go through the struggle and back and succeed. You guys have a blessed day out there. Go ahead and subscribe the channel peace I should need to know a couple things is she down for a nigga really fuck the game hey like is you down for the real me besides you wanna ride with you hope you feel me hating on a nigga